Articles The three little words a, an and the are called articles. A and an are called indefinite articles. The is called a definite article. Example There is an apple and an orange on the plate. An and the are the articles in the above example. Fill in the blanks with a and the. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. 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 Correct. Excellent. Gender. There are four genders, namely masculine, feminine, neuter, that is neither masculine nor feminine, and common, refers to both male and female. Example, boy, man, father, masculine gender. Girl, woman, mother, feminine gender. House, book, tree, city, it. Neuter gender. Child, friend, common gender. Rewrite the sentences changing the words in bold to the opposite gender. the following fantastic correct excellent fantastic correct Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Singular and plural. Singular denotes only one person or thing. Plural denotes more than one. Example, toy, toys. Box, boxes. Buffalo, buffaloes. Foot, feet. Mouse, mice. Match the following. Great! Choose the correct word from the box and fill in the blanks. Well done. Correct. Excellent. 
correct. Excellent. Correct. Excellent. Adverbs. Once we've learnt about verbs, we need to know which are the words that add meaning to the verbs. So, a word that adds meaning to the verb or qualifies it is called an adverb. For example, a very beautiful girl walked slowly on the ramp. The adverb slowly modifies the verb walked. The adverb very modifies the adjective beautiful. Identify the adverb in the given sentences. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Read the sentence. Choose the opposite adverb. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Adjectives. To make our meaning clear, we often use words to describe the thing. Such describing words are called adjectives. Example. Honey is sweet. Lemons are sour. Milkshake is cold. A cup of tea is hot. Sweet, sour, cold and hot are the words which describe honey, lemon, milkshake and tea respectively. So they are the adjectives of the above sentences. Match the correct sentence with each picture. <coughs> Good going. Match the correct sentence with each picture. Excellent. Identify the adjective which describes the picture. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Choose correct adjective. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Choose an appropriate adjective and fill in the blank. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Choose the opposite adjective to complete the sentence. Excellent.
Fantastic. Correct. Read each sentence and choose the correct adjective. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Comparison of adjectives. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Possessive adjectives. Find the possessive adjectives. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Preposition. A preposition is a word placed before a noun or a pronoun to show in what relation the person or thing denoted by it stands in regard to something else. Basically, it tells you about relationship. For example, there is a cow in the field. Where is the cow? In the field. He is fond of cricket. The dog jumped over the gate. Here is the watch that you asked for. What are you looking at? The boy stood on the burning deck. Choose the appropriate prepositions. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Excellent. Fantastic. Correct. Personal pronouns are pronouns used as substitutes for proper or common nouns. All known languages contain personal pronouns. English in common use today has seven personal pronouns. First person singular I. First person plural V. Second person singular and plural U. Third person singular Human or animal female, she. Third person singular human or animal, male, he. Third person singular inanimate, it. Third person plural, they. Examples. In each case, the first example shows a subject pronoun, the second an object pronoun. I like coffee. John, help me. Do you like coffee? John loves you. He runs fast. Did Ram beat him? She is clever. Does Mary know her? It doesn't work. Can the engineer repair it? We went home. Anthony drove us. Do you need a table for three? Did John and Mary Beat you at doubles. They play doubles. Beat them. When we are talking about a single thing, 
we almost always use it however there are few exceptions we may sometimes refer to an animal as he or him or she or her especially if the animal is domesticated or a pet ships and some other vessels or vehicles as well as some countries are often treated as female and referred to as she or her here are some examples this is our dog rusty he's an alsatian the titanic was a great ship but she sank on a first voyage my first car was a mini and i treated her like my wife for a single person sometimes we don't know whether to use he or she there are several solutions to this if a teacher needs help he or she should see the principal if a teacher needs help he should see the principal if a teacher needs help they should see the principal we often use it to introduce a remark it is nice to have a holiday sometimes it is important to dress well it's difficult to find a job is it normal to see them together it didn't take long to walk here we also often use it to talk about the weather temperature time and distance it's raining it will probably be hot tomorrow is it 9 o'clock yet it's 50 kilometers from here to cambridge possessive adjectives are used to show ownership or position the possessive adjectives are subject pronoun possessive adjective i my you your he his she her it its we are they their for example that's my folder my is an adjective which shows that i am the owner of the folder a possessive adjective is similar or identical to a possessive pronoun however it is used as an adjective and modifies a noun or a pronoun phrase for example i can't complete my assignment because i don't have the textbook in this sentence the possessive adjective my modifies the noun assignment what is your phone number here the possessive adjective your is used to modify the noun phrase phone number the cat chased its ball down the stairs and into the backyard in this sentence the possessive adjective its modifies ball choose the appropriate personal or possessive pronouns correct excellent fantastic correct excellent fantastic correct excellent fantastic correct